Now, in the wake of the dawn attack in Manda Bay, Lamu County, some of the residents living in Manda are fleeing the area. All those who heard the heavy gunfire and explosion describing it as the most horrific experience ever. And as Enoxicolia reports, a good number of residents in Magogoni village, which neighbors the Kenya and U.S. naval camps, have fled their homes and will only return once their security is assured. In droves, they walked out of their home to the unknown. The dawn attack at Manda Airstrip had sent shivers down their spines and it was time to evacuate. It was an experience 86-year-old Rosemary Chalo had never thought would come her way. She describes the heavy gunfire that ensued between KDF officers and Al-Shabaab militants. The loud explosion coming from the Kenya and U.S. military camps near the airstrip and the fear thereafter for Rosemary, who is not a resident of Lamu. In fact, she set foot in Lamu a few days ago, visiting her nephew. <laughs> Walipo wadhini nao wali walikuwa koko nao wakaanza kuwadhini Walipo wadhini kukaanza kupigano Milio ya risasi kaanza kutokezea na Mbule tisikawa sinapitia hapa juu ya hapa Na siwa konga hata hii ni ya tangi ya maji Na sikini silikuwa sikianguka kule And that is how Rosemary's intended beautiful stay with her nephew in Lamu was cut short. She has been forced to flee Mugogoni village in Hindi division At least until her security is assured nikawa jana usiku kufika saa kumi kuelekea saa kumi na moja tuliona lipoko bomu kubwa kubwa ilikuwa inarushwa alafu pande pande ya pili pili ilikuwa ilijibiwa sasa kufika paka saa kumi na moja tunaona hali sio hali ilikuwa moshi mbaya sana inaruka huko an experience that has made Abd Galgalo move out of the village located 200 kilometers away from the military base and some neighbors camped for safety in the early hours of Sunday as explosions and heavy gunfire rent the skies and airwaves. According to Galgalo, their whereabouts are yet to be established. <laughs> Hassan Chonde, the chairman of the Hindi community best policy, agrees with Galgalo. He itatatiza masomo kesho na jua kautara primary pengine haitafungua. Sabu wazazi wengi wa metoroka. Kwa hivyo hakuna vile wataleta watoto pale na kuna hii hali ya usalama si mzuri. Lakini tunaimani, tunaimani serikali tafanya kitu. But as residents call for help from the government, a multi-agency security team enhanced security checks for people living and coming into Lam and Oxycolia, Citizen TV.